Mom and the Minis, and today we have all the brand new DuckTales, the reboot toys. Okay, this was a series, an animated series by Disney back in 1980, the late 1980s, and uh, as Mommy said, this is a reboot, and on Rotten Tomatoes, it has 100% um, on the tomato meter the animated series. So when we saw these toys at Target, we grabbed them all up because not only um, did Mommy watch this when she was a little girl and all of her brothers, but um, if it's got 100% on Rotten Tomatoes, it must be awesome. It must be <laughs> awesome. So we want all the toys. We're going to watch the DVD, which has um, several of the episodes on there. Um, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven episodes. And if you have never watched DuckTales, you really have to um, tune in because Huey, Dewey, and Louie, who you'll be introduced to uh, with this toy unboxing, get into all kinds of um, adventures and mysteries and antics and mischief. And it's just a blast to watch. So if you like like mystery episodes of cartoons and you like adventure and that sort of thing, kind of like a Scooby-Doo kind of a thing, you'll really love DuckTales. So we want to just kind of go over the boxes real quick, what we, what we found, and then we'll get everything unboxed and we'll play a little bit. So here first we have the little figures. This is Huey and Dewey. Right, and Huey, Dewey, and their brother Louie all go to live with their Uncle Donald, and then they end up um, going to Scrooge McDuck's Manor and staying there. And um, so it's just, uh, they're a family that um, connected because Huey, Dewey, and Louie no longer have their parents. So see, these are some of the char characters. Here's Donald, here's Scrooge McDuck. And then one of the adventure characters is Launchpad McQuack, and we have his plane today. And um, Flint Heart, Glom Gold, Louie, and Webby. Webby is the housekeeper's granddaughter, and she also joins the boys in their adventures. So that's kind of fun to add that they've added a girl. Um, Webby was in the former episode, but I'm just saying that we have an, a girl in our adventures. And then Dewey and Louie. So. And then we've got... I picked these up too because these little comic books, these are from Disney Comics. These are so awesome. I looked inside here and um, what fun is this? Um, old school style comics. And uh, the artwork is so cute. You'll get to read a lot of the big adventures that they have. Here's one, Big Trouble at Little Lake. That sounds like a lot of fun. And um, as you can see, it's just really cute. And I think the adventures in these will really entertain kids, you know, with summer reading and things like that. So, Mysteries and Mallards, and, um, this is just the same thing, another comic book. So look for those at your store too, because reading is good, kids. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so this is Mom Show, Huey Dewey. Yep. Here's Louie. So their names are really easy, Huey Dewey and Louie. And um, their shirt colors, you can distinguish the ducks between their shirt colors. Louie is green, Huey is red, and Dewey is blue. But if you're like me, you'll get them confused all the time. <laughs> anyway, but here's something really funny. Um, this is not something you would have found in the 80s. Uh, cell, phones, A cell phones, right. So, and some other technology there. Really cute. But here's uh, the money bin and it turns into a play set so that looks like a lot of fun so this is a really big box i don't want to get it too close but you can store and display your favorite characters and we did buy not only these um larger figures in the two packs but we have a, a multi collectible figure pack back there we'll show you in a minute but you turn the dial to open the vault because see scrooge mcduck is a trillionaire so they go to um, stay with, Donald takes them to stay with Scrooge McDuck. And as you can see, he's just got troves of treasure everywhere you look. He's a trillionaire now. I'm not sure he was a trillionaire back in the 80s, <laughs> but now he is a trillionaire. 
So let's see what do we have up here. Fine Scrooge's number one dime inside. And um, just have some cute artwork on there of the characters. So we'll find out more about that when we get it open. And um, this does not go with the play sets, but I saw this as a giant Funko Pop number 312. And this is Scrooge McDuck, and he's in his money pile of all of his gold coins. And I just thought that was adorable. And since it's a character from both the original animated series and um, continuing with this um, 2018, 17, 18 series, we grabbed this too. So here are the other ones you can get in this DuckTales Funko Pop. You can get 306 Scrooge McDuck, um, which is the smaller figure, Huey 307, Dewey 308, 309 Louie, and Webby 310. So those are super cute to collect if you're a Funko Pop collector. Well, these are cool. I like how big it is. And this is only a Target. So if you want this deluxe, humongous Scrooge McDuck in a big pile of gold coins, <laughs> then you're going to go to Target to find 312 of Funko Pop collections. Um, then we have the little figure pack. Um, Mommy, you want to grab that? And in this, we also, again, have Huey, Dewey, Louie, Webby, and Scrooge McDuck. Yeah. I don't think Donald's in there, right? Nope, Donald's not in that one. Nope. No launch pad McDuck in our collector figure pack, so of course we had to get Sun Chaser, which is launch pad's plane that they often go on adventures in. And here's launch pad McDuck. He's a really a hilarious character in the show. So um, we had to get the plane because we have to have launch pad. Well, yes. <laughs> and of course, playtime is more fun if you have the vehicles too. So we had to have the airplanes. It says on the side here though that we have to build and play. So we'll have to be a little creative with, <laughs> with our uh, Yay, we get to instructions. Build <laughs> yeah, we have to make sure we pay attention to our instructions as we often do not. So that's everything. We're going to unbox everything and then come back. We'll see you in a minute. Okay, we're back. We have unboxed everything and we are ready to play. <laughs> okay, here we have the money vault. So we want to break into the money bin. Mom, show us how we can break in. Okay, so on the back we have a little knob here that we can twist and it should pop the doors open. I see the dime. There's the dime we found. The dime. <laughs> it's on its display case. <laughs> so we can um, bring our little characters in. Um, we have, uh, see, here I go right now already. We have Huey and Louie. <laughs> look at his face. He doesn't look like he's up to any good. <laughs> Uh, they get up to a uh, pretty good a lot of mischief, I'll have to say. And here's Dewey. He's ready to fight. He's got his game face on. <laughs> and Scrooge McDuck. His little glasses on his face. Super cute. <laughs> oh, those are good. Hers are pretty cute too. This is Webby. Make sure a little tail feathers first. But she's, you know, typical female. She thinks she, you know, has the answers. Of course. <laughs> she's got a cute little dress on, and um, she's ready to go. She, nothing's going to hold her back. And Huey. I showed you already, but we need to get him placed into the play Oops. set. So. I'm knocking everyone over. That's okay. Webby well, we can, she can take it. She's back right up. She's tough. Yeah, dust her stuff off. Okay, so then we have Launchpad, who came with the plane, the Sun Chaser. And right now we're going to put it together because it's a build and play set. Here's the body of Sun Chaser, and we've got the uh, money logo on the back there because that's what trillionaires do. <laughs> <laughs> if I can figure this yeah, out. Yeah, I think it's backwards because I think your propellers are going to go front side. Oh. So there you go. Well, duh. <laughs> well, see, that's why we... 
But this is how we do it. Process of elimination because we do not like instructions. <laughs> We'd rather, you know, just figure it out. Figure it out. If it doesn't go that way, it'll go the next way. Works pretty good for us most of the time. It just takes us a little longer. Okay. Um, hmm. Yep, you got it. That's for landing in water, of course. If it'll let me snap it in there. There we go. Oh, good job. See, now they can land anywhere. They can land on land or they can land on water, hmm. which their adventures often These take them into all snap. sorts of terrains. So this is a little bit harder, guys. You might want to ask your mom and dad to help you. If you're struggling a little bit, they can get it snapped in there. Maybe. I sure maybe, can't. Maybe dad will have to do it. I can't get it. Right, maybe you see. can try. Or, or Mims. Let's see what we can do here. That other one went in, but that it one did. just it did. seems to want to be stubborn. Okay, this is something we're gonna have Pops help us with later. So right now, we'll just go ahead and show how Launchpad um, sits in his plane. So you just open up the front here, oh, and it opens up to this cool there's little this control panels. And there's room for him to just, well, maybe, hold on. Let me get him um, <laughs> situated here. Launch pad, why aren't you going in? His legs bend. Oh, that explains it. <laughs> All right. And there then you is. just close the door and he's ready for takeoff. All right, You awesome. need a little window there so you can see him. That, oh, that'd be cute. Yeah, these, these tiny windows are painted over. But me, you know, he's an espionage. <laughs> <laughs> so, that works. So that's super cool. All right, I wonder, do any of these doors open or just slipped up in any way? Because there is, um, oh, here's a rear cargo area. Oh, that's cool. So, yeah, you can put some rear cargo in there. Looks like you might be able to fit a character or two in it also. I was just wondering if maybe the body of the plane opens, but it doesn't look like it does. But that's okay. This is super fun. And just to, before we... Whoops, I'm knocking over Scrooge McDuck's. <laughs> Before we finish up for the day. Oh no! <laughs> there's been an earthquake. Wherever <laughs> the mansion is located, it's on a fault line. <laughs> We've had an earthquake. But that's okay, they're all intact because when you have a basement full of money, your building is never gold <laughs> plunge. Your, your building is never gonna fall down. Oh no. So it's got a golden foundation. But well, here is Huey and the larger character. Just wanted to show these real quick before we finish up. Huey. And um, Dewey, and these are great for collectors. You know, um, there are a lot of toy collectors out there that look for reboots of um, vintage. <laughs> I just can't get this right <laughs> here. Webby, we're here. Webby, you're, I'll get you in the safety zone. <laughs> Here's Louie. And, uh, yeah, this is a great collector's item as well. Not only is it great for play, you know, toy time, play time, adventure time for younger kids, but um, you kids that grew up in the late 80s, here's a great new collector's item for you. And these came with these larger figures. These are some of their adventure and espionage and spy gear, things to help them get through their adventures. This will, this will this will definitely save yeah. them from, <laughs> from have to, trouble. Yeah, they can shoot their shoot their way out up, <laughs> yeah, and climb up the rope. Night Spy goggles. goggles. Yeah, night goggles. And we have not watched the more current series yet, which we will definitely be doing right away. Um, like I said, we didn't know about it until we saw these toys, so we're super excited to get viewing the episodes. But um, that's a little journal or some kind of a secret notebook or something. So we'll have to find out exactly what the characters use these for. But these are really cute little add-ons for fun play. 
And the cell phone, of course. Like. Well, nobody can do without a cell phone. <laughs> not Whether anymore, you're in not a, these a spy days. adventure or a mystery or not, you need your cell phone. Well, this looks dangerous. <laughs> it does. That might be something they found in a feral's tomb. <laughs> and they're taking. But, you know, also, um, I read that Scrooge McDuck um, has some Pep. kind of artifacts from his adventurous path that they um, discover. And so that that might be one of them. I don't know. We'll find out. This is like a little know, stun gun or something. I was going to say, sure. this is different. <laughs> it almost reminds me of like the Nerf guns that are out yeah, these days. Some, maybe, <laughs> maybe they Nerf or paint gun their opponent. <laughs> the bad guys get paintballed. Berries? Maybe that's the paintball. <laughs> <laughs> Super cute. All right, guys. So here is the new DuckTales by Disney Adventures. Um, the toys that we found, there may be more coming or more out there. But we were super excited to find these, and so we wanted to bring them to you right away. Make sure you subscribe to our channel because we're always on the hunt for brand new toys and the newest toys on the market. So if you subscribe, you'll be able to be alerted right away when we have a new video uploaded. Yep, and make sure you like this video. Um, and comment down below. Are, were you guys big fans of DuckTales? Are you guys gonna watch the new series? If so, do you, or if you have, do you like it? Well, and um, also if you would like to um, comment as far as um, your favorite character, I'm gonna go with Webby be, just because, you know, she's up for anything the boy, the, and she's outnumbered, but she's up yeah. for anything they have to dish out and any adventure and antics they get up to. So I'm, I'm going with Webby. What about you, Mom? I, I like Webby too. Okay. So well, I guess we'll have to down, share. <laughs> we can share Webby because hand down, hands down she's cool. So, But thanks for joining us today, guys. Thank you guys for joining us. We'll see you soon. Bye.